What's up, y'all? It's your boy Piranha Head. This is the 75 gallon fish tank right here that we got eight baby piranhas in. I'm finna do a word change on them and let y'all see how I do my word changes on my 75 gallon tanks. It's already like an uh, inch from the top of the tank, the water level. I don't like my water level high. Piranhas don't really jump out the water. They dash, they dash and dip and then go back down from my experience. I only speak up my experience most of the time. Mostly all the time, mostly only, but when I do word change, I take it down to like, probably like, like a right, right about right there. I call this, I think this is about 25%. I say about right there, and then I'll go back up. So let's get this party started. Let y'all see how I do my word changes. I got a, uh, a thick, thick pump too. It's like a, uh, I think it's a, uh, what is it? It's a half inch, I think, or something like that, hose. Don't quote me on that, for sure, for sure. But, and I got a uh, a big head pump. I forgot what it's called, though, which size it is, but I got a nice size pump. It was a uh, large and a medium, and I never used a medium, but, well, hold up. This the medium right here. No, this the, uh, this the uh, small. The medium a little bit bigger than this, and this is a super small one. So basically, like, this is the largest one out of all of uh, th this brand that I use. I can't remember the brand. I've had these pumps for a while. But if y'all want to know, then y'all can, uh, reach out to me and I uh, find out for y'all. I'll let y'all know where I get them from and everything. All right, just about where I uh, take my water to. I'm gonna let it go a little bit more. No, that's cool. Right about, let's see, uh, right there. All right, see, this is a strong pump, man. It's a real strong pump. Uh, unplug it and then I'm about to set it up to put the water back in all right y'all I got my hose set up make sure you get some type of clampers too to keep your hose and all that stuff clamped down for one go going everywhere so you ain't gotta stand here and hold it especially if you're a blogger like me you want to have both of your hands but let's go turn the water on all right we got that thing running y'all Runners over in the corner, they don't like being on the same uh, side as me when I'm messing with the tank, so they're all dipped to the other side, mostly all the time. Unless we're doing the feeding the sun, sometimes they come over. The babies normally stay on uh, one side and they swim around, I'm not super close though. But, I'm gonna put this boy back up to about like right here. Very we good. That water flowing in, that fresh water y'all. The temperature of the water is at uh, 76. So we good, we in there. That's about right for them right now. I don't want them to be too energized and fighting and nothing like that. Cause they're already fighting a lot cause they uh, baby fries and that's all they do is fight and want to eat. These days, I think they, they, they're aggressive when they're younger, man. <clears throat> they're aggressive at all ages, but probably when they get too old, probably not too aggressive. And when they young like this, man, they real aggressive, man. Like they fighting right now. Well, you will let this thing go a little bit more, then you'll turn the water off, and this will be the NLR water change. Let's go through the NLR water change, girl. That's how I do it. Like twice a week for these dudes and all the other piranhas, too. Twice a week, y'all. Almost there. Let's get in close on these dudes, man. You see they fans, they fans beat up, they been fighting, man. Ooh, ooh, they just fighting just now. They aggressive, man, these are babies, man. They don't, they don't play. Watch their behavior sometimes. They aggressive, they hungry too, it's today feeding day. Y'all can look forward to a uh, upcoming feeding. But y'all, that's the end of one word change right there. That's about like as high as we need it. And this, this, this is a water change. That's a basic water change for the uh, baby piranhas. I don't really clean their gravel because mm -hmm. I got big rocks at the bottom. Like, I ain't really nothing to clean. I'm gonna just let the uh, filter suck whatever it can up. And that's basically our basic water change for the baby piranhas. That's the end of it right there, y'all. Let's go turn this water off. Turn it straight off. Waste no time. All right, we done. That's it. 75 gallon tank. Eight piranhas in it. We done. The temperature dropped down like one degree. Spray will drop down another degree. It don't drop down too much. The water don't change that much because we only do 25%. Probably drop like two or three, sometimes four, depending on. See, it just dropped again. It's at uh, 74. Probably gonna go no 
lower than 73, so they cooled. They ain't gonna, they ain't gonna affect them at all, the drop of the water, because it dropped uh, with the, over time. Now, if it dropped fast, then they affect the water, and it might have an effect on them, and you would see them swimming kind of crazy and funny and everything for a second till they get back used to it. But that's the end of the word change, y'all. Peace out. It's your boy Piranha Head. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you like the word change video for the 75 gallon fish tank. This method should work on whatever kind of fish you got. You won't really do too much than 75%. I see a lot of dudes talking about 50%. I feel like that's too much, man. 75 is cool unless you do it twice a week. But peace. Thanks for watching. It's your boy Piranha Head. Thanks for watching.